Today is Wednesday, February 9th, and this is Citrus TV Now. It's currently 43 degrees and cloudy in Syracuse. I'm Bradley Hoppenstein. Here are today's top stories. New details on New York's masking guidelines. New York State Governor Kathy Hochul is ending the indoor mask mandate for businesses. The mandate for public schools will remain. Businesses will now be allowed to enforce their own mask guidelines. SU's Vice Chancellor Michael Haney sent an email to the university body earlier today. Haney said they will continue to monitor shifting public health guidelines. He also said SU will continue to inform and update all university students, faculty, and staff on their masking decisions. DPS is not releasing any further information regarding an arrest that took place at the Whitman School yesterday. DPS says they responded to multiple reports of a physical assault occurring in Whitman. Officers arrived and identified the suspect. The student is being placed and charged with physical assault and resisting arrest. SU sent an email to students regarding the situation. The university says it will investigate the procedures and protocols used by the officers during the arrest. And SU's iSchool is updating its academic program. The school announced that it has added two new majors to its academic catalog. The majors are Applied Data Analytics and Innovation Society and Technology. Students can begin adding these two new majors to their schedule in the fall 2022 semester. And coming up on News Live at 6, Super Bowl Sunday is nearly here and Citrus TV is taking over. We have reporting live from Los Angeles. Citrus TV's Jaron May has the latest from LA at 6. Till then, that's all the time we have for you today on Citrus TV Now. For more of the latest, follow us at Citrus TV News on Twitter or check out our website at CitrusTV.com. I'm Bradley Hoppenstein. Have a great evening, Syracuse.